After nearly a decade of effort, the ground has finally been broken on a new school building. Since 2003, five bond issues in the Independence Community School District have failed. But in September, a successful $12.48 million bond was passed. KWWL's Kara Mashek shows us how everyone is pitching in to get the school off on the right foot. These students represent each grade level at Independence High School. While the two upperclassmen will never get a chance to attend classes in the new building, they were excited to see the new school, nearly 10 years in the making, finally take shape in their hometown. It's nice to see the progress in our town and see a new building, even though we've been trying for so long. It's finally exciting to see it actually come true. Oh, I just love how it's brought up the morale of the town and the school and everything. Younger students look forward to all the new building will offer. Definitely the gym. I'm involved in a lot of sports like volleyball and I like going to the basketball games. I think it will like, we'll get a better education and more people will want to learn more and stuff and they'll actually pay attention. Students will continue to play a key role on the look and feel of the new building and the district says the community's involvement has been crucial every step of the way in getting the green light for a new school. Everyone has felt a part of this, and so it's our day collectively as, uh, you know, our whole district, our whole communities are going to be celebrating today because we all had a hand in it. A group of local farmers have even donated their equipment and labor to prepare the school site for construction, work that would have otherwise cost the district and local taxpayers about three million bucks. As an in-kind group, we wanted to help with the property tax for the people that are on a fixed income and the elderly, we want to keep the property tax down. The farmers already have the equipment to do the work, and we just need the time to do it. A local independence company, Larson Construction, has just been awarded the $20 million bid to build the new school. And with the ground now officially broken, work can get underway. Even once costs for project alternatives and furnishing the building are added in, the price tag for the project is expected to come in under its original $28 million budget.